Want to hear a tip on how to have more energy? Hey, I'm Heather, your certified high performance coach. And today I'm going to talk to you about three tips on how to have more energy. Now you might be thinking, how is that even possible to have more energy? Because I'm exhausted like all the time. And I'm definitely not my kiddo who can run continuously for 45 minutes and not only not be tired, but be energized from the running. True story. Or maybe you're the person that comes home after a long day of work of serving the needs of other people and you come home and you're just so exhausted and drained that not only do you not have energy and presence with your family, but you don't have energy for yourself. And the thought of even doing something to replenish that energy sounds even more exhausting. Maybe you're the person that has a job or a boss that they just can't stand. Or maybe there's that one coworker that just sucks every ounce of energy out of you. And you're thinking, okay, how am I supposed to have more energy? How does that happen? Well, let's talk about that. So number one, make sure that you are taking a break for yourself at least every 50 to 75 minutes. All you have to do is take two minutes for yourself. You can totally take more if, it is, if it's within your bandwidth and it doesn't disrupt the flow of what you're doing, but at least two minutes, every 50 to 75 minutes. Stand up if you're at a computer or have been sitting for a long time at a desk, do some stretching, do some breathing, move away from the computer or the screen, and just take a few minutes to yourself. Say some things of gratitude to yourself, things that you're thankful for about the day, or do a breathing technique, throw on YouTube or TikTok or anything to get grounded again. So two minutes, every 50 to 75 minutes, I guarantee that's gonna help you right off the bat to have more energy throughout the day. Number two, every day, make sure you're doing 30 minutes of movement. Now, I'm not saying that you have to carve out 30 minutes of crazy uh, HIIT training or strength training, um, unless that's something that you love to do. Personally, I enjoy it. But if you are struggling just to get up and get any kind of movement, go for a walk, do some yoga, do some stretching, maybe throw on your headphones and just walk around the house for a little bit. Just 30 minutes of movement every day where you can re-energize yourself and just have some time for you. Number three is to do something weekly, every single week to reset yourself. Now this, this way of re-energizing yourself can be um, maybe doing some journaling or doing a bath soak. Um, maybe, maybe this is the time that you go for a walk and don't have any contact with anyone else. No um, headphones, no talking on the phone, anything. It's just for you. Something that you have protected time and space over so that you can reset every week. I love to do Saturdays and or Sundays as my reset day my Saturday reset or my Sunday reset. And if I can fit in both days of doing something a little bit of that resets myself every day of the weekend, I do. So find out something that you can do every week that uh, maybe it's at the same time or maybe it's just on your to-do list so that you have that, that space for yourself. I promise you that if you do even one of these three things, you're already gonna see a boost in your energy give it a try. I challenge you, I dare you to try it out, making sure that you're getting in a two minute break every 50 to 75 minutes, getting at least 30 minutes of movement of any kind throughout the day and doing a weekly recharge. Pick a day, pick a time and recharge yourself. And let me know how it goes. Speaking of enhancing your um, energy. I would love to have you join my workshop called Recharge, Refocus, and Renew. It's coming up on Monday, February 12th from 10 to 11 Pacific Standard Time, and it's virtual, so you can join from anywhere. And this is a great way to design a life of fulfillment and joy and enhance clarity. 
And I'll give you some more tips on how to increase your energy in that workshop. So if you try these things today and you felt like you had a win, then come join me for my workshop on February 12th. You can register at www.wellnessrecreation.com forward slash workshops. I can't wait to hear from you and I hope I see you at the workshop. Until next time, take great care and I'll see you next time.